What's up everyone, my name is Nagarka, welcome back to Armello. I hope you enjoyed the Barnaby and the River game, because I'm going into another game. Now if you enjoyed that, hopefully you'll enjoy this one, because I would like to go for a rot victory. I think that would be really cool. So I want someone that has some body, because I'm going to be taking some, some hits. Uh, one fight for each spell cast. You know, I might go with Mercurio, the little rat. Steals one gold from the owner of a settlement when you claim it. I think that'll be really cool, and like I said, I want to try playing uh, a rot victory. That sounds like it's going to be really hard. Basically, I have to get a ton of rot and go kill the king. And yeah, uh, we're going to be playing with a character I've never seen before also, this guy. Uh, I forgot what his name is. But we gain stealth and settlements day and night. I have unlocked two of these now. One health at dusk, guaranteed first symbol match on perils. That actually sounds perfect. Because perils are something that I'm going to be probably facing off against quite a bit. Because I believe some perils can give you rot. So it, what I'm going to be doing is actually, uh, it's going to look weird, but I have a theory on how to get a rot victory, and it involves dying a lot. So, if you see me just dying a ton, it's part of my plan. The rot brings Sana closer to death. How do you start with rot? Um, let's see. Removes bounty and gives impunity while equipped. Spell cards cost one magic less. That gives me a wit and... You know what, I'm actually gonna go for this because I want the fight. That's right over there, not bad. Um, let's see, I start with... Hmm. Teleport to furthest dungeon. Yeah, that's not really something that looks good to me. Both heroes gain plus one gold per turn until... Right, I can't play that yet. So I'm going to move over here. Move over here. Oh, this isn't a movable tile, okay. But I am getting a little bit of gold, and I'm going to set down a peril. Actually, where is Sauna? I'm going to set down a peril in there, because I know that Sauna is a magic character. I would like to mess with her a little bit. Brune, that's his name. Brune. I believe he is the Oathbearer? Um, I don't know. Also, sorry if I'm pulling up stuff during their turns. I like to, I'm trying to keep track of like all of their stuff. Ooh, get the lit, lit, litning strick. She got all the litning stricks. Hmm. Ooh, there, that's what I want. I'm going to go fight that. That's the thing I'm going to go fight. Because if it kills me, I get rot. I may not be prestige leader for a lot of this, by the way. She's at 3 rot already, jeez. I wish I was at 3 rot. That would be so good for me. There's a spirit stone there. I almost want to take it just to prevent someone else from getting it. But I'm not- I don't think I'm going to. I think I'm going to go... One, two, three, so I'm gonna take a damage. Uh, Sana is dead. She gained a rot. Jeez, everyone is getting rot. Okay, so what I want is spell cards, I think, because... I think a lot of them have rot on them. So let's see... What are we getting? Some gold. I'm good with gold. And then take a hit, and then come over here. Um, remove bounty and gives impunity wall equipped. Uh, I'm just gonna sneak past the guards. Guaranteed prestige, guaranteed fight. And in battle your opponents have minus two dice until the end of target's next turn. Uh, teleport to furthest dungeon, that's not something I can actually do unless I use moon juice. 
Um, I need... Bane is right here, so I'm actually going to be going to that. Let's see... How much gold does he have? He has four gold. So I don't really want to play that on him. Nope, I'm just gonna end my turn, check out my new quests. Uh, this is... yeah, I don't want to do that one. Let's see, Squire. Yeah, Squire looks good. Having an extra body. And he is going for Spirit Stones, okay. And I'm doing this partly because the other two wins were pretty easy. And also because I just hear this is like so hard to do. Like it is not an easy win condition. So I'm just, I'm trying it out. I think it's going to be really cool. Mm-hmm. You guys just hiding in the bushes? I can't see you. She took a hit. You see that Bane? Bane over there? I'm prestige leader, oh my god. Well, I'm probably going to lose a prestige when I die. The King's Madness is apparent. All heroes swap their hands of cards with another random hero. Uh, any hero with Rot suffers a minus one prestige. I do not currently have Rot. And one other person has... Um... Has Rot, so I'm going to... Right? Yeah, two other people have Rot. But they aren't the ones with prestige, so that was kind of a waste, but I, I don't want to split my hand with anyone. Okay, so the Bane is over there. Uh, let's see. Teleport to furthest dungeon. Let's... Plus body. Yeah. In battle, opponents have minus two dice until the end of target's next turn, so I'm going to... Plus two magic and cast that on myself also. So my fight against this dude is going to be insane. Yeah. Come at me, Bane. I'm not sure if I want to actually beat them or if I want to die to them. I think I want to die to them because it gives me rot. But beating them gives me prestige, so either way it's good, right? Like, it can't be that bad. Dead. Dead. See, I got a prestige for that. And then I can attack Zasha. What's up, Zasha? It's so easy. And then the Bane might kill me, which would be good. Yeah, you got minus two dice. How does that feel? You only need- you only have one health, but I'm not gonna kill you. In fact, she is gonna beat me. Damn. Alright, Bane, I'm counting on you to come kill me. So I can get some rot. So far, I'm not doing good on my rot victory. Two turn- three turns in. Damn it. Stop getting gold. But I do have two prestige. That's... That's good. I don't think anyone is going to beat me on prestige later. Unless I die, which... I, it's so weird. Like, I want to die, but I lose prestige. You know? Yeah. It's weird. His rot is up to three. Oh, and it put it right next to Brune. Oh my god. The game is cheating for Brune. Okay, Bane's moving. I see you. So let's get at least one trickery. Minus one apparel difficulty. Minus one health per magic spent when cast costs all remaining magic. And let's get an item. Plus one action point, minus one health. Okay. Huh. I'm gonna fight the Bane and hope it kills me. 
That's my goal, is to die to the Bane. Because it should give me a rot. I still have the minus two dice thing on him though, so that's kind of bad. No, he didn't kill me, damn it! Bane, you are doing terrible. I should have stepped in the poop first. <laughs> I'm just gonna keep chasing it until one of us dies. Do you see? I might even... You know what? I'm giving him an extra dice. Or er, I'm taking away one of my dice. God, God, kill me! Thing. <laughs> Maybe my fight is too high. I don't know. <sighs> the freaking mirror enti image or mirror entity is messing with me too. Like, I'm giving him two minus dice, so I'm trying desperately to die to him. It still hasn't killed me. I may not be going for a rot victory if this keeps up. I might have to switch my plans. I may have to switch my plans. Really? Banes will never attack- oh my god! That's not what I want! Whatever. We are no longer going for a rot victory. We're not going for a rot victory, we're just gonna try to kill the king. I can't believe that. It gave me such a good card. The title of this is going to have to be To Rot or Not. Ugh, I can't believe that. I tried so hard to die to the damn Bane and it just would not kill me. I'm so prestige leader. Yeah, other highest is one. Uh, what was the other victory? I can't remember what the other victory was. I know there was four. Uh, all bounties are now worth plus one gold and plus one prestige until the end of the game. Uh, the king has raised an eerie fog. All heroes gain stealth until the next dawn or until they're spotted. All bounties are now worth one gold and one prestige until the end of the game. Okay. Sure. I mean, that affects all of us, so. Sounds interesting. I can't believe that. Freaking Bane card. The Bane's Claw or whatever. Let's get another item. Plus two health. And these aren't equipable items like I really want. So let's come over here. Come over here. Get the health. Minus one health per magic spent when cast. Cost all remaining magic. Spirit range 2, okay. I just want a peril difficulty. Hmm. Both heroes gain plus 1 gold until... Let's see, who has low, low, low gold? Sana or Zasha? So, Sana, I think I'm fine with you having gold. And teleport to furthest dungeon. I can't even cast that. So, end turn. So Brune has two spirit stones. I might just have to go to kill the king without spirit stones. Like an actual fight with the king, not my cheaty cheaty plink one damage king is dead fighting the king. Which totally caught me off guard. I was not expecting that to happen. Okay, she got a trickery card, lost a prestige. And they are doing some crazy things. I'm just gonna adjust my seat right quick. Okay. So they killed each other. Great. Also, I, I just saw on Twitter that uh, another Let's Player, Sergeant Kenai, uh, Chris, Chris Peterson, may want to do a collaboration with me on this. So I might 
in the future have uh, videos with other play people. Like I said, I just don't know how it's going to work playing online and trying to record because sometimes I can't, like I have to step away. Target is exiled to nearest unoccupied mountain. Cool. So, what we're going to do is this. I'm not going for Spirit Stone victory, mind you, but I just want to peril difficulty, get in here, and remember I have the thing, that means my first, I have the ring, watch, guaranteed first symbol match on peril, so this is actually a one challenge peril for me, which I totally smoked, if you didn't know. And Sana. This is actually going to be interesting. Let's see. Where can I... Where's Brun? He's somewhere over here. Let's actually place this on one of my settlements, which is this one. So I just placed a peril, so if someone goes there they might get exiled. And minus one health per magic spent. I don't need that. As long as the Bane doesn't move onto my Bane, I should be good. Bloop. Damn. That looks cool. He lost a fight. So I shouldn't have to worry about being rotted. <laughs> I'm like doing the absolute opposite of a rot victory. I have a thing that makes it so that Banes won't even attack me, so getting rot is like near impossible. Unless I play silly spell cards that make me get rot. She equipped battle armor. Minus, ooh, so Zasha's hard to kill. And she encountered my peril. Prestige leader. Dart and weave across the kingdom. His agents of misfortune sabotage all perils in the realm. Dungeons and stone circles are now restricted. A bounty to anyone who entered these tiles before the next dawn. Yeah, enjoy that, guys. So do not go into dungeons or stone circles. I can do that. Yeah, see, she got exiled. She tried to go into my place and got exiled. Suck on that, Sasha. Let's get another trickery. Both heroes gain plus one gold and eh, one more trickery. Minus two health if the tar if if kills target plus one rot. Oh, that's I don't want that. I don't want that at all. Pff, I really want the squire, so I'm gonna risk it. Come on, nope. I lost a health. But I gained a health, so... Really. Okay, and now I want to head... Let's go into the mountains. I really don't want to use this. Because it gives me a rot. Um, let's see, where's Sauna? And I, I still don't have magic enough to play this, so I might have to go into perils to get rid of some cards. The wild foretold your thing. Who did he put a bounty on? Oh, he put a bounty on me! There's a bounty on me, what a jerk! This one's a fight, this one's a spirit. Um, yeah, I really don't want to go for another Spirit Stone victory. That one seems kind of easy. Just a little bit easy. So I'm going to try to avoid that for right now. Ha. Huh. She's going to take over a settlement of mine. I, I could have. 
Oh no, I couldn't have. I couldn't have done Plague Bearers. I was gonna say, I could have periled it, but I don't want the rot. Mm hmm. Spirit Stone over there. But if anyone tries to grab that before the dawn, bad things are gonna happen.